So in this problem, uh, we've got a cyclist applies her brakes for 40 seconds, reducing her speed from 12 meters per second to 9 meters per second. Calculate her deceleration and the distance traveled while braking. So we're going to go straight in with SUVAT. So what are we told? Um, they uh, apply the brakes for 40 seconds, uh, going from 12 meters per second down to 9 meters per second. Okay, now first of all we need to calculate her deceleration. So we're looking for the acceleration, uh, so we're looking for the equation that doesn't have the s, and so that would be number one. So v equals u plus at. So we've got the v, which is nine. We've got the u, which is 12. We don't know a, but we know the time is 40. So 40a. So that means that gives me an equation where I can rearrange to get a, 9 take away 12, and then divide that by 40, and I get minus 0 0.075 meters per second per second. So that is the acceleration. The deceleration would be 0 0.075 meters per second per second. So if I was going to give my final answer in the exam, I would say the deceleration is 0 0.075 meters per second per second. Okay? So just to be careful on the sign there. Then we want to find the distance uh, travelled while braking. Okay, so assuming that I don't have that A then, I'm going to go straight in to find the S. So now I want the equation that doesn't have A involved, and that's equation number two. So S is equal to one half U plus V times T. I want S, so I've got the one half times U, 12 plus nine, times by the t, which is 40. So we've got the 0 0.5 times 12 plus 9 times 40, and that gets me 420 metres. So that is the distance that she travels while braking on her bike.